Well, I actually live only 20 minutes away from Cabrini, so I've heard about it since I was very little. Uh, my mom works with some Cabrini interns at USLI, so she thought it'd be a good idea for me to come and just check it out and see what the soccer team's like. I attended Marple Newtown High School, um, which is in Newtown Square. Um, I received MVP my junior and senior year for the team like awards. So I came, I ended up falling in love with it. I liked how close to home it was. Well, my freshman year, since I'm obviously very short, um, a lot of people didn't think I was going to be good or they didn't think that I was going to be able to keep up with everybody on the college level. But it turns out that I'm pretty, I, I fit in very well at the college level. Um, my speed kind of really helps. I'm very fast. So even though I take a lot of hits, I can get by multiple people by using moves, that kind of stuff. Between going to classes and then going to soccer, I don't have much time to have much of a so social life. But um, in between classes, I try and get as much homework done as I can before soccer practice so that after soccer, I can just go home, relax, do whatever I want, go hang out with friends, go out to eat, do that kind of stuff. But during like game days and everything, that's completely different. I just I have to focus on the game that day and I don't get to really do anything else other than go play. Well, last year I got MVP of the championship game. Um, I also received ECAC Player of the Week and I got second team all-conference. I'm just looking to win another championship. We're the only, we'd be the only team to win four championships in a row in our conference as a women's soccer team. So we're really excited about that. That's our ultimate goal. But I would also like if we do win our, champ the, our conference, I would also like to win our first NCAA game because no team in Cabrini women's soccer history has ever done that.